Hey guys, so today I'm going to print out another model. This is another one of the dragon uh, models I found on Thingiverse. This one's going to be a box that's got a dragon on top of it and the, the lower part of the box has all kinds of decorations on it. I'm really interested to see how this turns out. I'm going to go ahead and uh, switch over to the red uh, Shaxon PLA, give that another shot. It turned out really good on the last model. Uh, this time I'm turning down the temperature down to 192. I'm going to see if that uh, kind of straightens out some of the stringing. I believe it will. Anyway, I'll set everything up and I will see you at the end of the time lapse. Okay guys, so there we have it. It looks like it printed alright. Uh, the, the support that's supposed to be underneath the dragon's chin looks like it failed. But all in all, it's still, it's still printed. There's some stringing underneath it, because, because, of course because of the support failed. I can cut that off. It, it doesn't look like it hurt the model that much. And then this little stringing up here um, I've been told you can use a heat gun, so I did pick up a heat gun from Harbor Freight. I'll give that a shot on it real quick and see if that helps it. So let me grab the heat gun real quick and see what it looks like. Actually, it's going to be this one right here. I picked this up today. Uh, they had it on special for like $7.99 with a coupon. <laughs> so I'll pull it out of the box and we'll give it a shot. Well, unfortunately, my camera app failed on my, on my phone. Um, I did cut off the, the stringing underneath the chin, and I used the heat gun, which was right here, and fired it up on high and, and hit the spots. It cleaned it right up. I haven't any, done any further cleaning to it. You can see where it kind of shriveled up in spots, and so I can cut that off with a knife or scrape it off with my fingernail here in a little bit. But it cleaned up really nice. I really like the way it turned out. Uh, I used a knife just to cut away, just so I had a pocket knife on me, to cut away the support material that was here and then back here, and then it turned out pretty good. And then this is the lower portion of it. It printed really good. I did hit it with a heat gun just to, to straighten up the spots on it a little bit where it uh, had the stringing. But it turned out to be a very nice model. Let me just zoom in on it so you can see the detail of the box itself. It's not smooth. It's textured all the way around. It's a very, very cool model. I have a hard time getting the camera to focus on the on the box because of the color of it. There's a lot of it. Then down here on the dragon, see the top of the box has got a design on it. The dragon is t textured as well. You can't really fill any uh, layer lines to it. Looks like it turned out really nice. And of course the bottom of it, because on build tech, is kind of a matte finish. Same way on the box. Inside of it turned out really nice. I'll put a link to this uh, model in the, in the video description. And also uh, give credit to the gentleman that actually came up with it. There's uh, the original file was just the box itself, but without being sliced and opened up and anything like that. And this other gentleman took it and opened it up, put put 
created the, the inside portion of it. I did the cutaway and all that. Anyway, I'll put both the links in the video description so that everybody's got credit for it. But it really turned out nice. I like it. And this, this printer is just working great. Uh, I did have to size this down to 75% of the original size. Uh, because of the bill volume, it was just a little bit too big for the bill plate. So that was no big deal. But it, uh, I think it scaled pretty good. The printer is working great, though. Uh, I just can't believe how, how nice it's working right out of the box. Anyway, that's going to do it for this video. If you like it, please give it a thumbs up. If you like my channel, please subscribe. I sure appreciate it. Have a great day and take care. Bye.